Hello, this is Mike Powers from Zeta Sky. And today I'm going to give you a tip on how to share a document in Microsoft Teams. There's many ways to do it, but this is, seems to be the easiest way while you're in the document and you want to send it to someone in chat. Basically what it'll happen is you'll share that link to the same document and from there you could actually collaborate but you don't necessarily have to send the full document and upload it into Teams. So it, it works out better that way and it's something we recommend. So let's let me show you how that how we're going to do that. Here I have an Excel file, have some contacts, and I want to send that to a colleague. Well, the first thing I'm going to do is go over here to share. I'm going to click on that another window will pop up and either you can enter a name so for instance I will enter a colleague of mine our CEO or you can even just do it across the board for people in your organization so any internal team members that you send this to with the link will be able to access it so I'm just going to do it that way once you do that then if you want them to modify it, change it, you know, not just view it, you can go to allow editing and you're going to apply the settings. Now the easiest way is to go ahead and click on copy link and it creates a shareable link. Take that again, hit copy. Now let me go to Teams. Let me pull that up and so I'm going to send it to our CEO, Adrian. And I'm going to go ahead and just control V or you can paste. And there it is. I have that document link so when he goes to click on it he'll view the same document I'm in and if we wanted to we could collaborate I'm gonna go ahead and send it and as you can see it's sent now you can go to that link click on it and be able to share it without sending over the data or filling up your files in here So that's kind of the easiest way and what I'd recommend how you could share a document as you're chatting with someone or you want to share with an internal team member. I hope you found that useful and if you like these types of tips go ahead and like or subscribe to us on our YouTube channel and you'll get notification of other teams tips that we'll be releasing here in the future. Thanks.